2011 matric exams to get underway today and suspect in the Florida school go murder to appear. From a news desk, I'm Nebo Changela. The 2011 matric examinations get underway across the country today. Learners' first exams include computer application technology practicals and information technology. The exams run until the 1st of December. The last papers are religious studies and design theory. Gauteng Education Department spokesperson Charles Patlani says his department is ready for the exams. We have a number of centers in the province and 88,000 full-time learners will be writing the exam and we have 35,000 part-time learners. Although this week it's practical papers, um, next week will be the real start of the metric examination when the majority of learners will be writing English first educational language on the 24th of October. Provincial education departments say they've taken measures to protect the integrity of the metric exams. Western Cape Department spokesperson Brian Schroeder staff members in the department that are very experienced and we are confident that that will go well. Of course, an examination is always something where along the line and chain there are people involved and your security is always just as good as the weakest link in your chain. Uh, We are vigilant. We're not concerned about it. We have strict security in place all along the line and we certainly hope that nothing goes wrong because all that it does is it jeopardizes the future of our candidates. The man arrested for the kidnapping and murder of a Florida schoolgirl will appear in the Krugersdorp Magistrate's Court on Gauteng's West Strand this morning. 17-year-old Louise Duval was kidnapped while walking to school last Wednesday morning. A child body believed to be Duval's was found at a farm in the Mahalisburg later that day. On Thursday, a 35-year-old suspect handed himself over to the Margate Police in Kuzunatal. He allegedly confessed to the crime. Tabupakhani reports. Police say the suspect faces charges of murder, kidnapping, sexual assault and rape. More charges could be added. Police are investigating whether the suspect could be the so-called Sunday serial rapist who raped a number of young girls in Gauteng and Northwest on Sundays. The police is Novesu Tumasie. Currently we cannot say the man is the Sunday serial rapist. We are, however, having 10 cases that we are investigating that are having the same modus operandi as to the case. Meanwhile, a memorial service for Louise Duval will be held at her school on Wednesday. Tsepo Pakane, CBC News. And three people have been killed in an accident near Hamaskral, north of Pretoria. Paramedics say the car the people were in overturned after what is believed to have been a mechanical fault on the trailer they were towing. When emergency services arrived at the scene on the N1, they found a man and a woman dead on the scene. Another man was critically injured and died en route to a hospital. In an earlier accident, 13 people were injured when a taxi overturned on the Atlokweng Boshhook Road outside Rustenburg in the northwest province. The driver lost control possibly when a tower burst. The taxi was on its way from Rustenburg to Madikwe.